بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم We will speak today about minimal invasive technique for trigger finger release Trigger finger is a very common problem which is mostly encountered in the orthopedic practice It results from thickening either of the tendon bully which is called A1 bully at the site of the metacarbophalangeal joint or thickening of the tendon itself cause limitation of movement of the finger. The patient can present with difficulty in flexing and extending the finger. The cause of trigger finger may be unknown or idiopathic or maybe secondary due to rheumatoid arthritis or in diabetes mellitus. It begins as a discomfort at the site of the MEB joint. It has a most predilection for the thumb and it may affect multiple fingers. The tendon sheath begins at the site of the MEB joint and ends at the distal phalanx. The A1 body is found at the MEB joint. This transverse fibers Otherwise, the C fibers were crossing, crossing fibers. They are attached to the underlying, underlying bone and the polar plate. This is the A1 bully, which is found at the site of the MEB joint. The, the most important section is the digital nerves and the vessels, which run parallel to the tendon sheath and be beside the tendon sheath itself. For the thumb, they run obliquely at the site of the A1 bully. The signs and symptoms of trigger finger may be difficulty in flexing and extending the finger, my sometimes stiff finger, palpable nodule, uh, difficulty in flexing, flexing the finger or extending the fingers. Maybe flexion deformity. No lab test is needed for diagnosis of trigger uh, finger, but may be ordered in if we suspect another etiology for the trigger finger, like rheumatoid factor or uh, blood glucose level. X-ray mostly is not indicated, but can be ordered if we suspect uh, bony uh, injury or bony abnormality or lost body or osteoarthritis. The primary goal of treatment of trigger finger is to enable the patient to resume his activities. Corticosteroid injection is the first line of treatment for this deformity and achieve very good result. We inject at the site of the A1 bully around the tendon and uh, when it is early, it can cause, cause a good result. Another method for uh, trigger finger release is the bare continuous release. We use a large poor needle to release the A1 bully. The very common technique is the open technique. We make a transverse incision at the site of the A1 bully and explore the bully. And after that, we can release the A1 bully. Our technique is a minimal invasive technique. The technique is done under local infiltration anesthesia around the area of the, of the operation, around the A1 area. After we numb the skin area, this operation can be done in the office or in the operative uh, theater under complete aseptic precautions. After induction of local infiltration anesthesia, we introduce uh, 11, degree, uh, 11 degree knife at a 40 degree, 40 degree obliquity uh, to reach the A1 bully, which we palpated, we palpate the A1 bully by our finger to be sure that it is uh, under my my finger and after that I will introduce my knife parallel to the parallel to the uh, tendon 
she is parallel to the tendon itself to release the A1 poly from proximal to distal, being careful not to reach the uh, proximal phalanx uh, so as not to release the A2 poly, uh, which will uh, disturb the bowstring mechanism of the uh, tendon uh, sheath. The patient must be uh, cooperative during the procedure. We ask the patient to move uh, his uh, finger and tell us what he feel uh, during our procedure. Uh, the patient will tell us that there is some relief of the uh, bow stringing and the constriction of the finger uh, movement during our operation. And the uh, report, by, report by the patient is very important for us to determine the end of our procedure. After that, we will introduce a large pore cannula the metal one uh, 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 through our small incision to make complete release of the uh, tendon sheath itself. After the patient tells us that everything became okay, we will apply dressing uh, for three days. We immediately ask the patient to flex and extend the fingers and we remove the dressing after three days. The patient just take oral antibiotics and anti-inflammatory for three days only. All patients experienced marked improvement. Uh, two patients uh, complained of some swelling at the site of the A1 bully, which is subsided after some time. At the thumb, we be, are very careful not to do proximal uh, release so as not to inj injure the uh, nerve but we didn't encounter any problem in release of the thumb now we see how to palpate the finger how to make local injection how to introduce our knife how to uh, and the skin condition after three days this is our operation this is our operation. Steps of the operation. Incision of the bully. After local detection and incision. And using the knife to complete the release of the bully. Dressing. Yes, this is the mobilization by the mission. And dressing. After three days, everything is okay. It the body and release it by the knife. And using the cannula to complete the release. Ask the patient to mobilize his finger which, which became free movement. Dressing after three days. Now, as we found, no scar. And the patient is completely satisfied about the operation. This is a long-term follow-up after four years uh, for the patient. This is a scar of uh, bilateral trigger thumb and this is the patient. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> تسليك عصب آه. من أربع سنين تسليك وتر اه هو أيوة. والتانية مم. كان بعدها بسنة ايوه وابتدأت يتحرك دلوقتي اه الحمد لله حركة كده اه يعني بقى لها سنتين وثلاث سنين صح؟ لا ولا كام؟ أربع سنين وثلاث سنين أربع سنين وثلاث سنين اه ما رجعتش ولا اتخنقت ولا أي حاجة لا وشايف أصبعك كده مش باين فيه حتى مش باين فيه لا يد ولا عليه أصلا لا. العملية خالص لا خالصة. مش باين حاجة خالص اه الحمد لله
كان صباعي بقى واقف خالص بقى لما مؤاخذة كده زي الخشبة كده. اه. كان لما اجي اتني كده يقف. مم. يعني انا لازم انا اشده كده يطرقع على ما يرجع. ايوه وده برضه نفس الكلام. والتاني نفس الكلام. في نهاية الفيديو بشكر حضراتكم على المشاهدة الكريمة، يا ريت ما ننساش مشاركة الفيديو، الاشتراك في القناة، لو في أي تعليقات واقتراحات لموضوعات جديدة، وألقاكم دايماً في أحسن صحة وأحسن حال، والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته.